We're doing one of my favorite activities. Sketches. I love this. I love doing this. I don't know why, but Jen and I started doing this since we moved here to Tampa Bay and it's just so fun. We are making a late night Walmart run. These late night runs originally started um, when we first moved here, right? Yeah, because we needed a whole bunch of stuff for our, our house. Yeah, we had never, like, I don't know, we moved here and we didn't have anything for our house. Like, there's no ceiling we lights moved to upstairs. We a completely different city away from our family, so. Yeah, we and it was like, we were on our own, but the funniest thing I always remember is there's no ceiling lights um, upstairs and we assumed there would be, and we didn't have any lamps, so we spent the first night in complete darkness. That was so funny. The only funny. thing we had light was like hallway lighting and the bathroom light. Yeah, flashlights. Um, we've come a long way since then, y'all, but I don't know, it's like 10 p.m. and we're just making a late night Walmart run, maybe grab a movie, it's just the simple thing. Came things. here for a movie. Came here for Fantastic Beast. Fantastic Beast, which I have, I swear that Judd has seen it with me, but he says he Never hasn't seen, seen it. it. Maybe it was your sister. You guys are basically the same person, except she's a girl and you're a boy. <laughs> she's just a girl. What will we get into and find tonight? So we found Judd's movie. Actually, this one comes with both of them, the first and second one. I haven't seen the second one, and I slept through most of the first one, so we'll watch this. But I was hoping to get Disney's version of the, version of the Jungle Book, because y'all know Netflix made one, and I've watched both of them, and I am team Disney on this one, because the Netflix one is kind of unsettling, like it didn't really stick to the story and there are some disturbing parts of it. Well, you can get opinion. trolls instead. Oh, trolls, yes. It came, they took it off Netflix, I was so sad. She was disappointed. They have it. I love this movie, y'all. I mean, it's just so happy. Oh wait, they have Spirit. I used to watch this, okay, so I'm, y'all know I'm terrified of horses, but I loved this movie when I was younger. Who watched this? Come on, it's awesome. Also, if you've seen both the Netflix and Disney version of Jungle Book, which one do you like better? I'm Team Disney. They're on sale for seven bucks, so we're getting both. So many movies, movie night. So last time we came here, Judd was convinced. He's like, I know how to hula hoop. I can totally do this. <laughs> He's so bad at it. <laughs> and then he was like, well, I can do this other trick where I flick it back to me. And he couldn't do that either. <laughs> try it, try it, try it that way. <laughs> <laughs> it's the floor, sure. <laughs> Just hit me. <laughs> Instead of Wilson, you can get a Franklin. What? Instead of a Wilson, you can get a Franklin. <laughs> Does it say? <laughs> so I also tried it last time, but I'm not cocky like John. I was like, no, I know this is hard. It takes coordination. I feel like this is not gonna end well. You know what? I can't. I can't ride a skateboard. <laughs> oh, impressive! John, <laughs> I hope it was too far away for y'all to make that out clearly. <laughs> Harlow, where'd he go? It looks so disproportionate. You're such a big guy and such a small skateboard. Wow. <laughs> Is it better than a longboard or? It's like a mini longboard. Judd used to longboard a lot. It's still a longboard. I just don't have it in a while. <laughs> when I was in high school, people just used to buy cheap longboards and cut them off. Or you'd cut, you'd cut the tail off, right? <laughs> and you put longboard trucks and wheels on there. I did it through a skateboard and it was pretty cool. And everyone else in my high school did it. <laughs> <laughs> you were the trendsetter. Now Paul and I were. We were trendsetters. We brought our longboards a couple times, and the next thing you know, everybody's bringing their longboards. We're like, oh, we're not doing that anymore. One, dragging a freaking four foot long or five foot longboard was a bitch and a half <laughs> all day at school. <laughs>
I do not ride anything. I'm not good at it. But I hope to one day get a recumbent bicycle that's not stationary, that you can like actually, because then I'll be supine and it should be okay for my dysautonomia. I feel like that'd be good exercise. Judd, I will leave it. You are a bad influence on her. Are you a soccer pro? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> when I was like eight, I had a friend named Leonor. We were best friends in Still elementary school. Friend. Yeah, I mean, well, <laughs> Yeah, we, we've stayed in contact. She's like moved away and stuff. But anyways, um, my mom would get so mad at us because we were so mischievous when we were kids and we would take uh, like bouncy balls and chuck them over the aisles. You, just, you did that up until like a couple weeks ago. No, no. Oh wait, look. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do that anymore. What he's talking about was a late night Walmart run where I was playing with the bouncy ball and then things got a little crazy and it got away Jack from me. Jack also doesn't know how to play putt-putt golf. She doesn't understand the concept of putting. Actually, I'm going to play mini golf with my church group, I think next week. You just tap it. She's going full swing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to play it, but I think I'll just like hang out and observe. But I'm not athletically inclined Cheers. to anything. Riding a bike swimming, skateboard, any sport involving a ball, not my, I'm not an athletic person. That's okay though. It's yeah. a big piece, babe. Stop it. Stop moving. This <laughs> <laughs> is taking so long. Stop, there, just take that. <laughs> Give me another piece. <laughs> she can flip it and catch it though. Like uh -huh. we've been- Every time it goes over her head. <laughs> Yeah, but a few times she's caught it, right? Mm -hmm. She can do it with the coaster. <laughs> I don't know why, but Judd practices with our coaster. <laughs> you did it with the coaster. Stop it. Don't even look. I know I have another banana in my hand. Okay. Yay! Oh, she did it! Yay, hippo! Hello, hippo. Hello. Oh, okay. Oh, did you just... Ew, hello. Why do you have to be like that and burp on me? <laughs> She's so happy about it. And now she leaves, all right. Anyways, um, good morning, y'all. Last night, Jen and I forgot to end the vlog. We ended up, you know, just coming home from Walmart, and then we watched Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. We both enjoyed the movie, and then we just fell asleep. And I always find it kind of strange when the vlog doesn't end properly, like it just, are you burping again? <laughs> I also wanted to, <laughs> She really wants attention right now, as you can probably tell. Um, I also just wanted to like briefly mention to you all that, you know, last night we, we had no plans to pick up the camera or vlog or anything, but for some reason we did. And I, I'm, I'm glad we did because it was kind of a sneak peek into just our everyday life. Like that's what we like to do as a, as a couple, as a family, you know, our late night adventures at Walmart. <laughs> so I hope you all enjoy tagging along on that random adventure. <laughs> well, I said random adventure. I think it seems random to like film that and put it on my channel, but for us, it's not random. It's like one of our favorite things to do. And um, I know y'all like to join us on all our various adventures. So hope you enjoyed this video. And with that, we'll be ending the vlog with our sign off. Goodbye. And thanks for joining us on our adventure. Bye.